Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to our review of Death and Taxes. Two things we cannot get away from. But alright, actually, I played this over the course of about four hours. I beat it about a time and a half. We're about on our second playthrough right now. There actually is a bit of replayability to it. It is uh, the price on Steam tomorrow is about $12.99 American. Yeah, so I don't think it's actually too bad for this price, actually. But first, let's go through basically three areas in the game. Now you're saying a lot, but there's actually quite a bit to do. We'll pop in to see old Mortimer first. I, I know what you're thinking. I do provide ancient powerful widgets. And these basically kind of items you can get. Some really actually interesting ones that do affect gameplay. But a lot of aesthetic stuff, costumes as well. Right now I'm a little on the broke side. I do have most of the stuff. They do have a new game plus because there's actually... I, I, I wouldn't avoid the spoilers. It is quite a good story. Not initially. Once you start unraveling more, you start trying to figure it out. And that's the first time. And I have never saw that. But I've gone all this way down, but maybe I just didn't look. Interesting. I swear that was not there the first time. Wow, all right. Interesting indeed. I don't know. Yeah, but it does have a multiple and secret endings as well. I guess we gotta go. I'm gonna show off the dressing room first. Because I kind of went with Geralt, which it's Geralt of Rivia, Witcher 3. Uh, but it does have quite a few. I think I've unlocked most, if not all, of the faces. Plague Doctor. Always oh, very nice. Remember the furries if that's who you're into. And Cthulhu. Oh, bless the great old one, Cthulhu. Hail Cthulhu. Original. Outfit nice. But let's go back to that. And then quite a bit of outfits as well. Could be Santa Claus. A couple business suits. And I think there's a couple more we can unlock. I just... I'm playing a little bit. Yeah, let's just go Stone Cold Classic. But let's get into the meat and potatoes of the gameplay. Yeah, let's get to the office. Does remind you a little bit of paper, please, etc. Here's a note, but we don't need that. That can go to, out of there. Get your phone to check out up. Because everything you do will have consequences. Actions will have consequences. Your actions as well. Certain people live, certain people die. Which actually can snowball into other people dying that were on your list as well. So you kind of definitely got to read between the lines. Use your best judgment, I guess. And this little bit of Kutraman. You actually don't start with music, but I got a little music player here. There you go. Get rolling on that. That yeah, burglar died. I'm doing a good job. We've got some drawers you can put money in. Got a little squeaker. Nice. And they actually did since they got the review build about a week or so ago. The business of updates. Some additional voice acting, some sound effects, some other things, etc. So there might be more in uh, tomorrow's build as well. I'm not entirely sure. And this is a little bit of a spoiler. Uh, but yeah, there is a light that you can, when you get in the shop, it'll actually reveal. And actually, if you played a game already, it will show you if you killed this person. And actually, after the first game plus as well, because you can start with a new game with all your items. Uh, they will have new people you haven't murdered or saved. Yeah, I know. I You gotta mark a certain number of profiles. But we're gonna wing it today. We're gonna wing it. Alright, but let's just... We'll act with our heart. A true student for life. Christy has no intent of stopping their intent learning process. Break through with their fourth bachelor thesis. Your fourth. You know what? Reach for the stars, Christy. And you get to live in. What did that do? Oh, that was bad for everybody. That was bad because there actually are four things like nature, money, health, and peace. I kind of guessed on that one. That wasn't good. Christy should have died. I'm, I'm sorry. And there is an eraser you can get. It's for one time use only if you do screw up. But right, let's see. I thought maybe she was onto something. Emil went to college at 19 to study religion for the lulls. Decided to become a priest again for the lulls. No. 
Anybody that types lols just deserves to die. Oh, that was bad for peace. Well, alright. Frederick Hoag. Today is the monastery writing manuscripts by hand. Press for been centuries ago, they insist that text written by hand are just the most pure. That seems pretty okay. That one piece up. Alright, good. Alright, Mercury Saint Ions. Somebody came to granting charisma to Mercury. Could they do almost anything? Yeah, I'm sure it's fine. That was, oh no. Should not have let him live. Well, whoopsie. Whoopsie. Okay. Part-time scholar, part-time engineer, part-time musician who likes to build their own musical instruments out of scraps and spares parts. I swear I killed you before. I guess, uh... I say live. Let's let him live. Nothing happened with that, though. Maybe nothing that doesn't affect anything. Alright, but job done. Let's go report to the boss for the day. So definitely great voice acting in this as well. Let's head up. Grim. Ah, yes, there you are. Good, good. <clears throat> okay, now, listen up. <clears throat> you have allowed too many to live. Mm. You really ought to be getting the hang of this by now. However, I do not have the time to harangue you further at the moment. An emergency has occurred, and I must depart for a couple of days. Ah, so the cat's going to be in charge again. Yes, you will be... Uh, how did you know I was going to say that? I just had a feeling. Never mind. Means you are thinking ahead and up to the task. Now, I must go. And now the cat is in charge. Sadly, I wasn't doing my job. I did not get paid. But that's not what it's all about. I will get it one more day. Yeah, I really, eh. This actually was one where the plants, the, the plant department was busy, so we had to take over for the day. You can still write by hand, scientists baffled. Ha! It's done before plagiarized paragraphs and faulty research. Dang it! Why do we trust her? Bees are disappearing. We're in dry days ahead. Oh, that's, that's not a good sign. Plenty of food available every day. So that was bad for nature if it lived. So you're not, you're gonna die. Ah, so nature's good. All right. Also known as the meadow foxtail is grass. Uh, you get to live. Yeah, once you get this light. Uh, and after you play through it a couple times, I think you could really metagame it. Throw a tree in the in the dog park. Oh, that seems like that's that's good. I think I made that choice before. Yeah, living is much better for the tree. Branch tangled stems, each up a meter long. Come to brothers, growing the wild park, clean large patch of land. I feel... Have I done this one before? No, so I feel like you should live. Oh, health was down. Common name, rolling hens and chickens. Love sunbathing. I think we let you live. Alright, I didn't kill three plants. Ah, they can suck it. Ah, job done. Alright. All alone, Reaper. Power at your fingertips. 
It's electrified. I right, don't know now why, because they're setting you up. Well, who is? Fate! Everyone in the office. Haven't you seen them stare whenever you drift by? You don't have what it takes to succeed. You're a void. Yeah, you're just trying to rattle me. I am. Keeping you on your toes, right? It's necessary. Eyes like a lighthouse, Reaper. Watch your back. Be seeing you. It's kind of weird also, this voice that you hear in the mirror. I guess maybe your inner voice a little bit. Never really explained. That's only the, the weird thing I'd find about on this story. Doesn't have a really down, downsides. Like I say, max, you're probably going to get, I would think, maybe eight hours max out of this. Ignoring your presence. So. <coughs> the cat's upset. Oh, I do have a rubber gerbil. Oh, is that useful? Oh, the poor gerbo. Right, another day in the office. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I will leave you here. Ah, uh, silence your phone. I do heartily, heartily recommend Death and Taxes. Uh, yeah, max money-wise, usually I would say like a dollar per hour. We're not going to come up a little bit short on that one, but the production value is good. I found no bugs in it. I've, I've kicked the tires, etc. Uh, though the game volume was a little loud initially, I had to turn that down a little bit. Uh, but other than that, I can't find too many faults with it. But you will at least get a good weekend out of it. Uh, it is very good production. I did enjoy the story at the end. And it does have replayability at least a second time. Because uh, you're only going to get it right. Alright, but ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to hit that like button. It's helped a lot. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.